What's up, y'all? So a handful of people were mad about my last video, specifically for making a black joke saying they eat watermelon uh fried chicken grape juice um very stereotypical things first of all i'm gonna start off with if you were offended by that or hurt by that in any way i'm sorry i'm sorry that you were hurt that's not what i meant to do just hear me out real quick so growing up being a military child i grew up all around the world met and became friends with all sorts of groups and when i lived in monterey california i had a very good group of friends we called each other the domestic pigeons you can see some of them in my old pre-puberty videos but our group was a white guy a mexican guy a black guy and an asian guy we were a diverse group and that was when i was 12 13 you know pretty critical moments of my human human development we'd always be racist towards each other we'd always just roast the shit out of each other i remember one time we were talking about superheroes we said isaiah would be called black dynamite they'd always tell me oh what you have for lunch you got some sushi huh we just fuck around with each other and growing up with them we just joked about each other's races all the time we got dark with it no one gives a fuck we're all just friends all right and my quesadillas you guys you're all my friends, so I'ma fuck around with you guys too. So that's where I'm coming from. I lost a couple subscribers, so I hope whoever unsubscribed, you're watching this video and you can just see where I'm coming from. It's nothing malicious, like you don't gotta think I hate black people because I made a fried chicken joke. And to be honest, if you're mad about a fried chicken joke, you would get obliterated in the domestic pigeon. But seriously though, you just gotta know, like I'm all jokes. I don't got a malicious bone in my body. So yeah, don't, I don't, yeah, no, like no, nah, like no, nah, no. Nah. When I'm stereotyping and stuff i know it's a stereotype i know i know not all black people eat chicken i know not all black people eat watermelon all right but yeah if you did unsubscribe though um please come back i didn't lose a whole lot of subscribers but my case of deals on my friends and it's hard to lose friends even if it's just a couple especially on a bad note like you thinking i'm some racist even if you don't want to subscribe again i just want to let you know that you know if we ever meet in real life we can sit down have coffee and chat you'll respect me after that i'm a pretty i'm a pretty down-to-earth guy even though i might get a little stupid on camera i'm just vlogging talking out of my ass constantly trying to think of something funny to entertain you guys so yeah but also one more thing really fried chicken watermelon and grape juice joke that's what offended you even if i said that seriously like all black people eat fried chicken grape juice watermelon even if i said that 100 seriously it's really not a big deal being asian growing up i'd always hear small dick jokes slanted eye jokes i'm pretty dumb so people would say you're dumb for an asian most of them are joking and being my character I take it very lightly. Even if it's serious, I'm pretty, you know, strong-willed. I can brush that shit off. So after people saying stereotypes like I have a small dick, out of all those things, if someone told me, hey, you eat fried chicken, I would just be like, I mean, yeah, it's pretty good, don't you? KFC's right down the corner. We can like, we can go grab some if you want. But yeah, I mean, we all react differently to things. I can't force you to, you know, react the same way I do when I hear stereotypes. But I also want you to know where I'm coming from, where I'm just joking around. I just kind of grew up like, wilding out just roasting each other all the time and you're really dark and you're skinny all the time why you look like the dude on every crosswalk sign <laughs> tim de la ghetto what hood you from you just mad because i'm hitting your cousin sim Koo young <laughs> timothy de la ghetto i like the rhymes that you kick it but go back to your old job i want some kung pao chicken <laughs> we went to a restaurant and i ordered my chicken fried he ordered his chicken alive. Yo, Tim, you're real talented, and everybody knows. I'm amazed you did this whole show with your eyes closed. <laughs> and he think that I'm playing. Chinese dude, translate what I'm saying. Yo, uh, you know, my mom told me about that. She said it was amazing, because when she seen your d she thought you was Asian. You're a real smarty. But guess what? You're no longer invited to my birthday party. <laughs> It's just shit like that. Please don't take me seriously. So if you stop liking me because of that, I hope you can like me again. You can, you know, subscribe if you unsubscribe. Just know my channel, you just gotta roll with the punches, all right? That's how my humor is. Not trying to hurt anyone, but if you were hurt, then... I'm sorry. But yeah. Oh yeah, one more thing. A lot of people in the comments were saying, you can't act a race, you can't act a color. Which, yeah, if you want to get technical, I agree with you. Certainly not all black people talk like a certain way. But, let's be honest with ourselves here. When people say acting black, or I guess specifically talking black, let's not lie to ourselves. We know what they're talking about. I could have just ended that whole segment in the video by saying, you can't act a race, and boom, done. But I know what they're talking about, so I was just playing along. But many people in the comments were just acting clueless, like, come on you know 
quote. It's just the flow of the words. It's that ain't nobody got time for that kind of sentence. It's that chocolate swing. No shay, no shay. Let's be real here. We know what we're talking about, all right? Come on. Just like when people say talking white. Mom, Mason took my controller and now I can't play Fortnite. Mom, Phineas and Ferb are making a title sequence. We know what we're talking about. Yeah, technically you can't act white, but we know what we're talking about. Let's be real here. And yeah, I think that's all I gotta say for this video. All jokes aside, all roasts aside, I fucking love you guys. You know, sticking by my side, rolling with the punches. In the end, those who get me will get me, and those who don't, don't. And that's what my quesadillas are. You guys get me. That's why you're subscribed. You get me. If you don't, or you don't agree with it, I want to let you know that I definitely don't mean to hurt you or offend you or anything. But I'm gonna keep doing things how I do things, and uh, if it's not your cup of tea, don't drink it.